On low power, we are looking at a slide of the testis. We can see cross-sectional cuts through the seminiferous tubules. The pointer is on the basement membrane of a seminiferous tubule. Within the seminiferous tubule, we see cells undergoing spermatogenesis. Here, the pointer is on a spermatogonium in contact with the basement membrane. Now we're looking at a primary spermatocyte no longer in contact with the basement membrane, a large cell um, with visible DNA. These nice, round, um, dense cells are the spermatids, and we find them in clusters. Here near the lumen of the seminiferous tubule, we see the head of a spermatozoan, or a sperm. The heads appear flat and if you look closely you can see there are often little tails associated with these flat cells known as the sperm. Here we see other sperm clustered together. The pointer is right on the head. This connective tissue layer around the outside of the whole testis is the tunica alvaginia. A septum is seen to the right. This cluster of cells found in between the seminiferous tubules are the cells of Leydig. This um, pear-like nucleus is the nucleus of a very large cell, the Sertoli cell, or the Sustentacular cell, that actually supports these developing germ cells. Here is another nucleus of a Sertoli cell.